But my name's Darren Cullen, I'm an artist and I'm uh, doing a residency at RRU News. The second project I'm, I'm working on is um, a way of trying to draw attention to the fact that the Metro newspaper is actually owned by the Daily Mail, which I think is something that a lot of people aren't aware of. A lot of people uh, refuse to buy the Daily Mail because of its bigotry, its racism. But the Metro, on the other hand, as a brand, seems very unsullied by any of that history. And just by picking up the free newspaper, the Metro, you're helping Metro circulation increase. That means that the Metro is able to sell advertisements for a much higher rate. And that puts hundreds of thousands of pounds every single day into the pockets of the Daily Mail's owners. As a way of kind of trying to draw attention to this and possibly making people reconsider whether they pick up this newspaper, um, I've designed some stickers, semi-transparent stickers, and these go, if one were to stick them on something, they might think about sticking them on a Metro bin. So they've been designed so that they blend in with the actual design of the distribution points as much as possible, so hopefully they'll stay up for a lot longer. Staff won't notice them, but hopefully commute as well. So far, people have been putting the stickers up in London, Glasgow, Bristol and Liverpool, but ideally looking for people around the country who want to get involved. The stickers are available from our website, spellingmistakescostlives.com. The stickers are free, just asking for a bit towards postage. Anything that we can do to kind of dent the sway that the Daily Mail has over public life in this country, I think can, be, can only be a positive thing.